Week 10 of the USFL season is finally here. It's finally here. And the regular season is coming to a close. And although I am not watching any of these games this weekend, I do want to say that, you know, for the teams that are eliminated, Houston, Tampa Bay, Michigan, and Pittsburgh, all four of you, if you win the final week of the regular season, that's great. You know, Michigan and Pittsburgh are playing each other. Philadelphia and New Jersey will meet again in the semifinal. So, again, no reason to watch the Week 10 game between them. Come back for the semifinal. New Orleans taking on Houston. Birmingham taking on Tampa Bay in Week 10. Who cares about the odds? None of these games matter. Let's focus on the playoffs. And that's what exactly I'm going to do in this video. So that means you will see me again talk about the USFL on June 25th when it comes to the semifinals recap. And I'll go, I'll go a little, I'll, I'll maybe go a little bit over week 10 too, you know, but I'll be mostly talking semifinals and everything like that before we talk the USFL championship game, the USFL Bowl, or whatever they're calling it, you know, out in Canton, Ohio. So in Canton, Ohio, it will be the first game of the semifinals, Philadelphia and New Jersey. Um, for the Generals, Darius Victor, league leader in TDs, you got Cavante Turpin on fire. You know, Luis Perez quarterback, potentially could be DeAndre Johnson, you know, coming back as well. He, I'm not sure if he's come back yet or not, if when he's available. You know, he could, you know, get in there because he was helping the Generals offense out. You know, for Philadelphia, um, the Case Cook is the Bug Howard connection. That's going to be real big. Going to be a real big one for the Stars, you know. And both these defenses aren't up. Both these defenses can play. Both these defenses are wild. So, you know. You won't you don't you you're not gonna see much from the week ten matchup, but you will see something in the semifinal matchup from these two. And it's gonna be a slobber knocker in the semifinals, I'll tell you right now. But I am taking the New Jersey Generals to win their semifinal matchup. I'm taking them to win their semifinal matchup, but I'm taking them to go to the USFL championship. In the other semifinal, you got the New Orleans Breakers and the Birmingham Stites. Jamar Smith, he must play well with this dynamic receiving core of Marlon Williams, Victor Bolton Jr., who, you know, it was either him or Turpin that had, like, a, uh, a punt return touchdown last week. Uh, but Osiris Mitchell, you know, you got you got a couple of linebackers, DeMarquis Gates, Scooby Wright on this defense, you know, you, you know, two noteworthy linebackers that have been on the headlines all season long, the Stallions. You know, the Stallions may not be unbeaten anymore, but the Stallions, they still have a lot of fight in them. And you got the breakers on the other side of things. Zach Smith's been getting time as Kyle Sloter's been kind of inconsistent. Both these guys been injured, you know, the past, you know, the past week or so. So, you know, there's that. There's also Jordan Ellis in the backfield who's been just a big difference maker for the breakers. And the breakers are going to need Kyle Sloter to play well. The Stallions are going to need Jamar Smith to play a complete game. So both these quarterbacks in this other semifinal are going to need a complete game. You know, both these quarterbacks are going to need a complete game. It's going to be rough. It's going to be ugly. But I think both these teams are going to have a low scoring affair now. Keep in mind, the odds are not out. I have not found any odds for, you know, as far as like point spreads and stuff like that. Because they're not out yet, for whatever reason. But what I do know is that Barbie Cab is favored to win the championship. You know, with New Jersey right behind him, New Orleans in third, and Philadelphia in fourth as far as odds to win the title go. As far as the New orleans Birmingham matchup itself goes, I am picking the Birmingham Stallions to, to take on the New Jersey Generals in the USFL Championship. I know, kind of a cliche pick. I know people are starting to pick the stars too, but I think New Jersey and Birmingham are clearly the two best teams in this league. You know, Philadelphia at times has been inconsistent. You know, it's far too inconsistent. So is New Orleans, far too inconsistent. I think these two, New Jersey and Birmingham, are the most consistent teams, and consistency has been the key all season long in the USFL. And if you haven't seen that, then I don't, I don't know what to tell you. 
Um, I know people are going to dismiss the USFL because of ratings and stuff like that or the attendance or whatever, but I can assure you I am watching these semifinals with all the care in the world, and I am ready for these semifinals. If you are watching Week 10, God bless you. If you're not, good job. You know, there's other things to do on, on this beautiful Saturday anyway. Lacrosse. Watch lacrosse. Watch, uh, there, there's like some tennis going on. There's some baseball going on. You know, there's some other stuff going on. You don't have to, you don't have to subject yourself to meaningless football this weekend. But the semifinals, June 25th, Canton, Ohio, at Hall of Fame Stadium. Get, get up and get ready for a packed day. Remember, there's a concert in between the games. You know. Get ready. If you are going to Canton, I applaud you. I cannot. I do not have the funds to go. But if you are able to go to Canton, good job. Good on you. You did You did what you needed to do. You got your money ready to go to Canton, and you got you got it going. And I cannot wait to watch these two Sippy Final games. I hope, you know, we all have a good time watching them. You know, that, that is, it, it is what it is. So, until then, until the USFL City Finals conclude on June 25th, I will see you later. I will not see you, you know, on Sunday to recap Week 10. I will not see you sometime next week to, you know, like sometime in, the, in like, you know, during a weekday next week to talk, like, preview in the City Finals. It's already previewed them. So, June 25th, come back. And we'll talk the USFL semifinals, recap that, and get ready for the USFL championship. Until then, see you soon for both lacrosse and this week's indoor football on a beautiful Saturday night. Take care, everybody.